Hi everyone, I am Diane with Mimi's Life and I have a Timu haul. It's a real little Timu haul. It's not much at all, it's not very exciting, but um, I got some stuff in late yesterday and it says I got an order coming today. So I just thought I would jump on here and show you what I got uh, that come in. I'll just start it right off real fast. Ever since um, Angela over at Material Mom showed me the sheets that she got from uh, Timu, you know, I'm a sheets person. So she showed those sheets and I went on, jumped on there and went and got me some. And I love them. So I went back and ordered me another set in another pattern and I ordered my son some. Um, his are not just like mine. His are uh, a little bit cheaper. So, <laughs> don't tell it. But um, I got him some. And now I know where I'm going to be ordering my sheets at. They're a little pricey. But, and I'll, I'll show you his. I really don't want to take it out of this package because it's hard to get back in until I get ready to wash them which I'll probably wash them tonight so I don't know why I'm complaining I'll pull out one of the Pella cases and show you what the pattern looks like it's really pretty they feel really nice these are the cheaper of the ones um, what did it say oh I just paid $23.70 something on this $23.75 or something like that but here's the Pella cases but they feel nice. It's a paisley print. And he has, he just has a queen size bed. So, I'll get these washed and put them on his, his bed. But, I got those for him. I'm sure glad that she got on there and she, she ordered some sheets because... I've been kind of scared to order sheets on there. And here is the ones I got. This is the name of them. It's, uh, I don't know. I don't know what it, the name of them is. But these, I paid $57.49. I know y'all probably going, ooh, but they're good sheets. I mean, the ones that I have on my bed, they wash up so nice. And... They feel really good when you lay down at night. I'm going to take one of the pillowcases out and let y'all see the pattern. This pattern is so pretty. And they have these on... I need to scoot back or put the camera down some or something. They got these little tie deals on them where you can, you know, put them up. But this, in this pretty, this pattern... I love them. I love these. And yeah, I'll pay a little bit more for them because they're worth it. And they're, the pockets are real deep because I have a California king bed. And, you know, the mattresses are thick. And if you get those old cheap sheets, it, it don't go down and it doesn't tuck in on the corners and you're sleeping and they'll pop up before you know it you get up and all the sheets is wadded up in the middle of the bed that I can't handle so yeah I'll pay a little bit more for these sheets and I love this pattern I love this green it makes me want to get some green throw pillows and kind of spice up my room one good thing about me having this, um, I just do this white duvet, and you can do any color with it. Like, right now i got a throw blanket at the end of it that's um, all different colors. I'll just show you. I got this. This is a Timu blanket. But this here, I got this throat at the bottom of my bed to give it a little bit of color at the bottom. And then, of course, you know, you can do any kind of color pillows and all these are teamy pillows so right now I'm doing the blue and of course when I started I was you know 
when I redid my room, I did it in gray and yellow. So I have yellow pillows if I want to change that. But I kept my room this, uh, you know, this really neutral color where I could put any color with it. You know, I could do pink or whatever color I want to do. But knowing me, this spring or whatever, I'll be buying a new duvet to throw on my bed that's really flowery or something. But yeah, I got these two sheets and um, I'm really pleased with them. Next, I got this here. And this, I think, was like $16. And I didn't bring my darn scissors over here, but it's okay. I can take it off on the end. I'm sorry about the rattling of the noise. But this is a pet rug, is what it said. We'll see. It's a they said it's a pet rug like when the dogs go out and it's raining or whatever and come in like I have French doors on the back where the dogs go out or the dog goes out I just now got a dog or the kids got my son got a dog it ain't my dog but she's so cute I done fell in love with her but uh anyway when she goes out back or whatever when she comes back in her paws are muddy or what have you you know they said that it's real good for that or anybody that's going in the backyard and coming back out so this I think maybe it was 16 I'm not sure but I got the largest I think I got the largest but they said it's a pet rug so this is what it looks like it's pretty big it's pretty good size I'm gonna put it right at my back door and they had I think three different colors I chose gray because my um, my cabinets are gray in the kitchen, you know, and I have that black granite top in there. So, yeah, it, it feels really nice. And on the back side, it's got this rubber, and this is... I went ahead and ordered me some of um, those little strips that you order so the rug won't slide around. I ordered some of those. They hadn't come in yet. But I don't think I'm going to need it with this because this feels really... You know, what I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to order another one of these and put it at my front door. So, because it's, it's really made well. It feels nice. It's, it's nice and heavy. It's not like one of those. I've ordered some other rugs from them, and they're real foamy. They're foamy, and you put them on the floor, and you slide all over the place. You have to have something underneath it, because if not, you break your neck. So... Yeah, I'm pretty pleased with that. And let's see, next I got um, got me a pair of blue jeans. Somebody asked me if I would uh, order some blue jeans on there and, and try them out. So I ordered me a pair of blue jeans. Somebody else hauled these blue jeans uh, not too long ago I was watching. And they had hauled these blue jeans. But this is what they look like. This is, uh, I think I got an extra large in these. Uh, extra large, what is an extra large? It's like a 12 or something like that. Isn't that a shame? An extra large. I was wearing a medium whenever I first started this channel. So depressing. So, it's got little, ho it's got horses on the back of it. Like, they're so cute. I mean, I'm not crazy, crazy about the horses, but the reason why I wanted to order these is because I like low-cut jeans. I don't like high jeans. I don't like the way they look on me. I just don't have the figure for it. But, um, these says low-waisted jeans. So that's the first pair that I've ever seen team who have low-waisted. Have y'all seen them carry a lot of low-waisted pants? I've ordered several pair that said mid-waist, and I thought, oh, I can wear those. I got them here and hated them. They went way up above my belly button, and I don't wear my britches like that. So, but the girls, you know, took them. And I don't know how I'm going to like these, so we'll see. And it's got this little design here on the, on the pocket. And they're pretty big bells. So, I have a hard time with, um their jeans being long enough for me because I'm 
five eight five nine on a good day. That's what my driver's license says. But uh, what do y'all think? Have y'all ever like if they're too short to take the hem out of them? I don't know if I took the hem out of them would it have that really dark ring around them where you can really tell that I took the hem instead of them looking like they've been made like that because nowadays you buy them and they're already un unhemmed I forget what that is called but anyway so we'll see we'll see how they fit and if they're long enough I'll try them on so next I got um got this shirt and the reason why I got it was like three dollars or something like that, a little over three dollars. And I thought it was cute. It just has the uh, giraffes with the sunglasses on. It's soft. It's not like it's a little shiny but not a lot. I will not wear that shiny stuff. And it's got a little stretch to it. I got an extra large in it. So, that's that. And this is the last thing that I got. I don't have no jewelry. Can you believe it? But I got some coming. I got, I got my kitchen table. I got six chairs in there. And I've already bought these one other time um, from Timu the chair covers and the ones I got I, I've got a video I think a short video showing them they are like a light beige color and had like a flowery print on them that was a mistake because the light color in the kitchen with the baby not a good idea I know I can take them off and wash them but Taking them off and washing them every day is what I would have to do to keep them clean. And they're not easy peasy to put on. You have to unscrew all your your screws underneath there. You have to take your seat cover off. You put them on, put it back, screw all the screws back on there. So, you know, it's, it's a little time consuming with six chairs. So I don't want to take them off and wash them all the time. So I got these. And I think this is a better choice in color. I got gray, and it's got a little bit of a pattern on there. See the pattern? And um, they have these elastic strips on the back of them. And they are easy to put on the, on the cushion itself. You just put it on there, and it fits my chair. And my chair's got a big seat on it. Um... You just put it on there, and the other ones that I had, we t we had to tie these. We had to tie them because I wanted them on there real tight. I didn't want, you know, the material to roll up or anything. So, and then my husband, you know, screwed it all back down. So he's not going to be happy that I got these because guess what he's going to do this weekend with me? <laughs> he's going to unscrew all those screws so I can put these seat covers on. <laughs> but um, so I'm gonna change out my seat covers because it it looks sturdy and oh and they said uh, these here I don't remember how much I paid for them they wasn't very much at all maybe I don't know ten twelve dollars for all six of them they, they come six in pack I didn't count them I hope it's six see there's one two three, four, five, six. Yeah, there's six in here. Six to say, I know. So, yeah. I need, or I don't need, my son needs to get him another computer chair. His computer chair broke, and he's got my kitchen table chair in his room in front of his computer. So, he needs to buy him a computer chair. He already said he's going to go buy one this weekend. But for now, it's annoying. You know, uh, whenever I did that video with uh, Get Ready With Me, just a couple of videos 
ago. Oh, what am I wearing today? You ask. I'm wearing um, Timu earrings. These little, these little round pearls with the diamonds. They're so cute. But today I am dressed in um, thrift store clothes <laughs> except for my jewelry my jewelry is from Timu this bracelet here it's one of those that just wraps around your arm and I've had it forever so I don't know how to get a hold of that and these uh, came five in a pack and they're just those stretchy bands you know and then I have on uh, this Timu ring which is really pretty and then I have on this really unusual one it's got that stone in it. So I got this paisley shirt at uh, the thrift store over by my house. And I just have on, well y'all can't see, I just have on a pair of blue jeans that come from the thrift store. And I have on house shoes. I have on uh, Timu house shoes. And they're dirty. And I got on Timu socks, the ones that I bought um, seven in a pack for like two dollars and something. So, anyway, what I was going to tell you is, um, whenever I did that uh, Get Ready With Me, just a couple of videos back, I wanted to tell y'all that I got a comment saying that I needed to clean my bathroom door, that my bathroom door was dirty. And I was aware of that, but not aware of that until I did the video and I watched the playback on it. And I was like, oh my gosh, my door, where my door handle is in the bathroom, it's so dirty around my door handle and like right there. But that's my vanity in there and I have a vanity chair and the kids go in there and they sit down they put on their makeup and if you you're sitting there and you're putting on your makeup and you turn to open the door or do anything this way you're going to touch my paint around my doorknob and right there on the face of my door so it's touched all the time with hands that have makeup on it or kids that you know are going in and out and I try to keep all that stuff wiped down. Matter of fact, uh, just yesterday, I got on to the girls because their door was dirty. And we just painted my room and their room. My bathroom needs to be painted. It hadn't been painted in a while. But just painted my room and their room. And uh, my husband painted the doors too whenever he did. Their door was filthy. I got onto them and I made them clean their door and I made them clean the facing around the door. So, I want to apologize. I don't have a dirty house. I don't keep a dirty house. I try to keep it pretty clean and in order. So, but, um, yeah, thank, thank you that you brought my attention to that and I'm sorry. But I wasn't about to remake my whole video because that wall was dirty. I thought, well... I'll just tell them about it. <laughs> so I just wanted to say that. Say that, uh, yes, it was dirty and I should have cleaned it before I did the video. Some people are just picky picky and I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. But um, anyway, that's my haul for today. Oh no, that's I'm, I'm not closed and I can't close right now. I've got to try my blue jeans. Hold on one second, I'm going to go try them on. Okay, here is the shirt, which is really cute. I like it a whole lot. Here I am doing this bit again. Um, it's really cute. It's plenty long. And here's the blue jeans. There's the back of them. The horses. And this is how they fit. What do y'all think? I, I, can, I put them on without... Um, un and button them, unzip them. They're plenty big, that's for sure. But I don't know. I don't know if I like them or not. They kind of make me look fat. <sighs> what do y'all think? This is what it looked like if I tucked my shirt in. I 
can't see myself. I like this shirt. I think this shirt's really cute. So this is them. Now, they are kind of short on me. But they'll be alright because I wear flat shoes with everything. They're right at, um, they're right at the bottom of my feet. So, yeah. Only thing is, is they feel weird in the crotch. Like, the crotch area is kind of like, I got this much going on. You see that? Like, <laughs> that looks terrible. That looks nasty. So, I would have to constantly pull these things up because they're kind of big in the crotch. So, anyway, this is this. So, what do y'all think? Let me get out of it. Okay, guys, that was my video. Y'all can tell me what y'all thought about my pants. I got Sally down here and, oh, do you know, I think I did my whole haul without my ring light on again. There it is. I'm so sorry. I did my whole haul without my ring light on. I'm not going to redo it. I hope y'all seen it. I hope y'all seen everything really good. Sally, she's got my house shoe. Come here, girl. Come on. Come on. I'm going to go get her so y'all can see her. Come on, girl. Come on. Can't have my house. She crazy. Come here, big fatty. Don't pee. She pees when she gets excited. <laughs> She's a full-blooded German Shepherd. <gasps> oh, my gosh. Look at you. Look at you. Ah. <gasps> Yeah, beautiful. Yes, you are. Look how big her paws are. She's going to be a big dog. She's going to be a good protector for Abby, aren't you? Yeah, aren't you? Yeah. See if y'all can see her whole body. <laughs> Sally, come here. You better get off my bed, fat girl. Okay, guys. Uh-oh. My deal's falling down. Straighten me back up. <sighs> anyway, didn't have on my ring light. I hope you seen my haul. I don't want to redo it. If you're new, please subscribe. It's fun around here. I love and I appreciate y'all. Thank you for all the beautiful comments. And the ugly ones, too. <laughs> please give me a thumbs up. I appreciate it. I'll talk to y'all tomorrow. See you soon. Bye for now.